breaking news. The man accused of shooting and killing a police officer in Terre Haute now today officially charged with murder. Detective Greg Ferency was ambushed yesterday outside the federal building in Terre Haute. Detective Ferency served with that Terre Haute Police Department for 30 years. He had also been assigned to an FBI task force for 11 years. He leaves behind two adult children. In response, police departments all across the state tweeting out their condolences today, many saying their thoughts and prayers are going to their fallen brother. Police wanting to show their support were going to be able to do so at the Terre Haute Police Department. Detective Ferency's car will be displayed on the east side of the building there because that scene has now been cleared, no longer part of the investigation. And we're still waiting for the details on a vigil and funeral arrangements. We'll pass those along to you when we learn them. Rich Nye has been in Vigo County all day working to learn more about the man charged in Detective Ferency's death. And he joins us now live with what he's learned. Hey there, Rich. Scott and Anne Marie, we don't know why yet, but according to court records, 44 year old Shane Maheen, a man who ran for mayor of Terre Haute, came here to the FBI office Wednesday afternoon in Terre Haute looking for trouble. Now he's charged with the murder of a federal agent. And I want to tell you that the picture we're about to show you of Mahin, or Meehan, pardon me, is from a 2013 arrest in Marion County. The federal criminal complaint says 44 year old Shane Meehan came to the FBI office about 2.15 Wednesday afternoon. He threw a Molotov cocktail at the FBI building. Detective Greg Ferency walked out of the building, and Meehan allegedly shot him. Ferency returned fire, but died from his injuries. But to have somebody come, as you say, to our front door uh, and, and commit this kind of act is uh, a step beyond and um, affects us all immensely. Like I said, it's a small office, a tight-knit group of people, so it's, uh, it's definitely a difficult situation. Another FBI agent ran out to join the gunfight. Meehan was injured, but he was able to flee and drove himself to Terre Haute Regional Hospital in a gold Ford F-150 pickup truck. He underwent surgery and is in custody at the hospital. In the truck, investigators say they found a 45 semi-automatic handgun and three more Molotov cocktails. The FBI also raided Meehan's home in Terre Haute and gathered evidence. This is the same Shane Meehan who ran for mayor of Terre Haute in 2019. Detective Ferency served in the Terre Haute Police Department for 30 years and for the last decade was also a task force agent with the FBI. He was an amazing person. Whether it was about a meth lab or human trafficking, he would do everything possible to find everything about that particular uh, crime. Um, and he was a teacher. He, he did so many more things that I can't sit here and explain to all of you. Those of us that work with him know. Detective Ferency is survived by two adult children. FBI investigators still on the scene tonight. They've been working around multiple thunderstorms here in Terre Haute this afternoon to gather evidence. Meantime, the Terre Haute police chief says that Detective Greg Ferency is the finest person that you'll ever meet.